double dip. <laughs> hey guys, all right, hello IG. We are here today um, and we're actually double dipping. We're on Facebook in my free group. My name is Rachel Feldman and this is Jess Royston. And here we are in Facebook. So just give us one second. We just want to say hello to everyone. We are here because we wanted to talk about how Jessica built her business. All right, Jessica, tell everyone a little about yourself. Hey, so I, first off, I'm just so excited to be with this wonderful woman. <laughs> so exciting. We've had a crazy morning and finished <laughs> with lunch like two seconds ago, and now we're here for all of you guys. So I am a health coach. Um, I live in Jupiter, Florida, and I work for a functional medicine doctor. And um, I love helping people get their healthy life back on track. That is my mission. But this is the thing. Let's, yeah. I mean, yeah. okay. And if you guys don't know us and, or don't know even our relationship, yeah. let's even just break that, break that down first. And we were just talking about this. How we came to it. Yes. I graduated from the Institute for Integrative Nutrition, 2010. Jessica, 2011. And we have been online, like many of you guys, you know, we know each other online. And like many people, we end up either what? In analysis paralysis, yes. struggling with handouts, trying to find ways to bring high value to our clients. Mm -hmm. And then maybe we what? We find somebody and we were just saying right before that Jessica ended up buying a program from me. Yes. And then I said, wait, but how do we connect? And so what happened? So I stalked her out at IN Live and I was like, year, the program that I bought, I was able to help over 50 women go through a two week spring detox, like puffy eyes gone, skin better, digestion better, amazing stuff. So I paid her parking at IN Live <laughs> and I jumped in her huge car that was like four feet off the ground. And then when she came out, we were the same exact height. And I was like, and done. So we've been like working together ever since. It's but awesome. this is what I want to tell you guys, which is so insane, is that when I met Jessica and we were talking at IN Live, like right in Miami, we were talking about how many coaches are struggling. And I was talking about the fact that my first year, um, I made 13000 mm -hmm. yeah. And I had the moment where I said, either I'm going to quit and go back to commercial real estate, or I'm going to try to figure this out. In the second year, 27,000, which was better, mm -hmm. but it still wasn't for like many of you guys in that same place. You want to quit a nine to five. You want to get to the next place. You want to pay for a mortgage. Yeah. <laughs> you want to pay for all your bills. So Jessica is going to walk you through one, how she started, mm -hmm. how she collaborates with a doctor here yeah. and how she started with that process. But then two, how she's built authority using the done free programs and what that has done. All right. Go so here. And, and I will also say, see, even just the synergy when you are able to find your tribe, mm -hmm. get support, not feel alone. And all of a sudden, you're what? Able to interrupt your friend and yeah. go, what the hell? <laughs> Not on here after this. It's true. And that's what I think is really important and where we do get stuck mm -hmm. um, is we feel like all these other health coaches that have either graduated from school or now there's even more schools out there. Um, we see their online presence. They might have a prettier website, whatever. And you think they're killing it. And they're not crushing it. And then we feel like we're, like you said, like analysis paralysis. Like I can't launch a program because I have to take nine months before to prepare for it. Or the common thing that we hear because Jessica is one of my moderators because she had such quick success. And we hear what? What platform? What membership platform? Mm -hmm. Like all of those things. How many that, people on your mailing list? Right, like all those things that if you're a new coach. So I don't care if you're a new coach or if you're sitting there saying, "Oh my goodness, wait! I graduated like a long time ago. I haven't made money. I've spent 5k, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. Lot. Mm -hmm. Let's just take a deep breath. We've been doing this all morning. Okay, so now, we, now we're gonna move on because the thing that I have seen and what we talk about and one of the reasons that right away I was like, wait, what, Jessica? 
you you did what you were able to get people and which is why I wanted her not only to come on and talk about how simple it was for her to launch with no list, with no paid ads, and how much it reminded me of what I did because I was overwhelmed. I was scared. I didn't luckily have the money to, you know, look for any of those other opportunities. <laughs> I just yeah, had yeah. to like go for it. Yeah. So I want Jessica first to, well, actually, yeah, I asked you a few questions, okay. but now I'm actually going to take that yeah, back. Yeah, do it one at a time. Roll it back. Roll it back. <laughs> Roll back the fishing ball. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to say, because you even share this, what was the exact launch blueprint? Because I know yeah. everyone wants a blueprint. Yeah. I know. We're talking blueprint. to IJ. I know. Blueprint. And we're also talking to We'll Facebook. give you guys some attention, I promise. <laughs> You're here with us. Um, so blueprint, and I have this um, in Rachel's unit too, because we thought it was so important to do um, a Facebook live. I did a couple of weeks ago because I do, I've done the same thing now repeatedly and it's worked every single time. So you get the program, spirit fingers, <laughs> you download the program, you open everything up guys, and you read through it all as if you just bought it for yourself and that you're going through the program and you figure out, um, what you need, like a timeline of where you want to launch it. I am a very quick launcher as Rachel knows, like I will buy something and then I'm like, I'm going to launch this in 14 days. <laughs> and but that's also because you don't sit. And, and this is the thing. Did you hear like open up the Dropbox, yeah. edit the materials? Yeah. Like, like really time time. block and say, yeah, th that's it. I'm going to edit the materials yeah. right away and I'm going to do it. Yeah. And, you, and then it inspires you because when you see a program, on Rachel's website that feels right to you and it feels like you can be authentic in it, then you want to know that information. And every single time that I open up a program, I learn something new about health and that this is our job. So we're always learning. We're always students, but you get excited and then you want to bring that out to the world. So I always edit everything within, I would say the first 24 hours, like max. I did that too. Yeah. So, because then I know that you're And also I will say this because coaches used to say to me, I'm a nine to five. I have a family. I have an autoimmune, welcome to the party, mm -hmm. um, or I have small kids. And yeah. both you have small kids. Mm -hmm. I had Rachel's wellness with small kids. And so I would always say, I'm going to edit my own programs. Yeah. And a 14-day program took me two hours, yeah. start to finish. Mm -hmm. What did it take you? I would say about that, maybe a little bit less. Um, there's some really good content in it. So I was just like, Master, competitive, AF. One and a half hours. <laughs> Um, but then I would also like, I would just make sure that everything was organized so that when I was ready to launch and I did, um, like as soon as I went through the materials, there was something up on Facebook and Instagram, nothing like we just said, nothing paid, but just the people that have been following me and seeing that I am an authentic clean eater. And just by the content that I've been giving, they knew when I was ready to sell something, they were like, okay, this this girl knows what she's talking about. Um, I would get, I would have to be ready for people to sign up right away. So I had my website with the PayPal link to it because as soon as I put that out there, people were signing up. So I would do like, I think I did a 72 hour window where it was an early bird special. And then um, I did full price. And then right at the end, I did like, I think I did a 72, 48 and 24 hour reminder that signups were closed. And then when it was closed, I put another message up saying like, too late, you missed it, but here, join me for a mailing list for next time. And I actually filled up when I met you and I jumped in your car, <laughs> I had filled up another cleanse with the people that didn't make because it she, Because you did say like closed. And I think that's another thing that people get really scared about. I remember I used to be scared, like if I say closed, but you're creating urgency. And I will say the biggest thing, because people have contacted me about some of the testimonials like yours, or there's another woman named Christina Weiss. And they're like, well, there's no way that she did this without a list, without Facebook ads. The biggest thing that Jessica always did, and those that I've seen launch without this massive overwhelm, anxiety about like, you know, what do I need to have? Or I don't have Facebook ads or I don't have this or things aren't perfect is they always showed up way before and shared what their life was about. Like you constantly shared about gut health. Mm -hmm. You shared about your life with your kid, yeah. what was important. Mm -hmm. And you and I were even talking today, like yeah. green living, 
yeah. healthy living, you know, and so that detox like fit it into totally fit. the story. Yeah. It yeah. wasn't just like, I'm doing a ketogenic program. Like that would not have fit into the story. Yeah. And people so when, question. Right. So when you <laughs> say like, if you're picking a program, like yeah. don't pick something that you're like, hmm, yeah. that's trending. Exactly. But, you know, my neighbor's doing that. Right. So maybe I'll do, like, doesn't work. Like do something that you do and you're like, wow, this would just really fit. And people would be like, yeah, that totally makes sense that you're doing that. When do we start? Yeah. And that's what I think building um, influence and authority online with your clients, they want to see that you're actually going to be able to guide them through it because you are doing that yourself. So I have a blog called Green Mama Tribe. So who was I reaching out to? Moms that wanted to make greener choices. And Spring Detox was like, detox your life. Like we talked about getting the clutter out of your house and, and pulling greens in and getting the toxic stuff out. So people were like, oh, this girl does this all the time. Let me listen to what she has to say in the program. So there was no question about price and there was no question about what do I get and how do I do? Well, and I think there was also no question about price because this is a big thing. People always say price, like how do I price it? There's no question about price and somebody being willing to pay yeah. when there's trust. Yeah. So I see a lot of coaches, you see a lot of coaches mm -hmm. in our forum. We were just talking about one who was like, oh, I like... You know, she said, like the words were literally, I made back eight times the amount I paid for the restore your gut health, yeah. which is an 800 plus dollar program. And I sat there and I looked because I woke up to that and I was like, oh my goodness, <laughs> um, can I interview you? And she yeah. was like, yeah, of course. And I thought, okay, so I see other people who say I'm struggling to even get a client. I'm struggling to have somebody pay for even a seven, a seven dollar well, no one's going to pay if what they don't trust you because you haven't consistently shown up and connected the dots, told the story of why this is important to you. Yeah. Yeah, um, so and so, which is why I always say, if you're a new coach, at least show up for four weeks, start talking yeah. about them. Yeah. Talk about your life, talk about and connect the dots for somebody to say, wow, you know, this is important to me because yeah. either I struggled with this mm -hmm. and this is how I solved it. Exactly. Yeah. And then they can say, they can look at you and say, I can do this. She did it. I can do it. When, when they think that you're, you've gone to nutrition school for like a hundred years and that they'll never be able to do something. Um, they're, they're not going to look at you and have that trust. When they say you're a mom of a four-year-old and a seven-year-old boy and you're, and you're down to the max yeah. and you're doing it. I can do this too. And I think that's what we need to get across to people is that, that they can do it and, and we're their leaders to do it, but we're doing it ourselves too. And I think that's really important. Every program that I've bought, I've actually done myself because it fits in with me, which is why there are certain programs across the board that I wouldn't do. I am not a candidate for keto. I just, I don't, I, that doesn't work for my body. So Rachel's right. If I had done something like that, people would be like, how is this green mama like telling me to, you know, eat whatever that it just didn't fit for me. So when I go on her website and I see the ones that, that my target market, because they're just me, they're, they're copies of me. Um, and the people that I want to reach, they right away say, I know that Jess was feeling this way. She almost got her gallbladder out. She made some changes. Naturally. I understand that she knows what she's talking about. Like, let's follow her. So I didn't have, I don't think I had a business. I do not think I had a coaching business page. When I watched that. I don't think I did. I think but I let's, it on my first. But this is the yeah. thing that also that I talk about because when I sat there and everyone was like, "Oh, how'd she do this? How'd she do this? How'd she relaunch?" And she had even people. I went and looked at your personal page, and what I saw above that was, "Come to my gut workshop." Come. So, if you are not getting people, and I don't even mean like. Um, getting people just even your website. I mean, if you are not getting somebody even to opt in to the freebie that you swear that everyone in the world should opt into, or you have spent hundreds of dollars on the boost to the freebie that says, download this freebie. Yeah. People, even though I know this seems like, I'm boosting this, <laughs> I'm paying. Keep clicking the boost post. I'm, or even you're paying somebody. 
um, because both of us didn't start our business that way. And I'm not saying if it's, if it's working, continue to do it. But if it's not working, I do encourage you to, to step back and actually say, you know, does this really align with my ideal client? Does, <clears throat> does this funnel actually speak the message that I speak in my daily life? Or am I just kind of pulling somebody else's blueprint? We're always looking for a blueprint, trust me. We were just talking today as we're sitting in my office yeah. and there's a lot of blueprints. <laughs> <laughs> I've been reading that um, and because I'm like a mind mapper when it comes to blueprints and different different entry points. And because I feel and I know that each person's business is different yeah. and unique, so, just like in our health journey, yeah. my health journey with pylori and clostridia and fungus among us and parasites and all that great stuff that I have had um, is different from somebody else's. Mm -hmm. Just like your business is going to be different. So if you're stagnant and you're in that place where you're like, I see this other person doing a challenge to a webinar and this, well, guess what? I stink at converting challenges to webinars. I stink. I've tried it. And so I really encourage you to sit there and say, what works for me? And also what works for me with my bandwidth? And I think that goes back to like everything that you are talking about. It's like you always talk about offline workshops. Yeah. yeah. But yet you also work your programs online. online. Yeah. And I think because and I, I think I did a post in the group, too, about how. There was a period, if I'm being honest, that I said, like, forget it. I've been a health coach for 10 years. I'm not doing anything, like, not paid anymore. Like, no free, no more free workshops. And then a local um, physical therapy office asked me to do a free workshop. And there was probably, like, 30 people there. And that is how I filled up my next program. Because I went and I gave them information on anti-inflammatory foods. And I connected with them. And they saw, okay, this girl lives what she's teaching. And then as soon as I think it was a week later, um, I launched 21, 21 day clean eating and everyone was like, oh my gosh, that's just the stuff that she showed me on the website. Like that's, that's what I was hearing from her live the other night. And then they shared it with their friends. And that's how we gain the online space because you do need people to be advocates for you. So you're doing stuff in your local community for free and you're getting members. Like that's, that's a, a huge way to connect. And then you can bring it online to reach more people. And then, you know, I think that, and let's even talk about like the new coach, even going to that next place. Yeah. Because I think this is where it gets like, <laughs> we think that that means like, oh my goodness, I have to start like just adding on these platforms and the platforms. Mm -hmm. That means you take the existing system. And I don't mean a system that doesn't mean like click funnels or entreport or infusion soft or healthy or practice better. And again, that there's, I don't discriminate. You can love them all. <laughs> yeah. or you can choose which one works for you. That means that you take the exact system, like is it that you have a two-tier or three-tier work with me, and you start to add on different levels, or does it mean that you have a workshop that is paid that all of a sudden you turn that into a masterclass, mm -hmm. or you film it there, or does it mean that you do a webinar that is a two-hour webinar and you turn that into a $97 masterclass? You start to work smarter with what you're doing because you get comfortable because you're comfortable in the foundation that you actually built. All right. Before we end this, I also want to talk about something because what Jessica was able to do, and I see a lot of people doing this, but they're not doing it as seamlessly. That's the word. Seamlessly as just. I'm going to put that fist pump because she's a Jersey girl and I'm a Philly girl. <laughs> fist we pump speak the same language. <laughs> is that things can be really hard. Trust me. I went through painful stuff. It can be a painful process, but also things can feel seamlessly when you do it. One with alignment. We both always talk about that Two, When you have a vision that you are really clear about and you time block number three, and four, when you get the support to do it because you feel like you have the tools. And when you have that confidence, the confidence and the clarity, they go hand in hand. 
So let's talk about the next step that you even took in your business, which is that you joined network marketing that you really, and I, guys, I'm not part of this network marketing. So like when I, so when I talk or I interview coaches, this is because I see something that they're doing really well. And I'm like, okay, you're good. You're right. <laughs> you yeah. can help people who are struggling. The biggest thing we see in network marketing is retention. We also see what? that something maybe a saturated and she are like, I want to set myself apart. Yeah. But that's also even what in the wellness and health coaching business or the life coaching or fitness, it's still the same story. Yeah. But Jessica joined a network marketing company. She started to build what her confidence first. Mm -hmm. She found one that aligned with her. Mm -hmm. She tested similar to what I do. Yeah. Tested for nine months. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yeah. Just because be you had to really, she had to know similar yeah. to how I am that it really worked, mm -hmm. worked for her, worked for her family and would work for her clients. Yeah. And she used a program to have what we call a soft sell yeah. to set herself apart and to show more of a lifestyle brand. So do you want to share a little about that as well? Yeah. So this was awesome, and I'm, I'm, I get so excited to share this with people because I know that a lot of coaches out there are a part of network marketing, and I think it's another great stream of income. I know there's a stigma around it that we're trying to break because a lot of really good products are sold in network marketing. Um, but I think, like Rachel said, the number one thing I always beg coaches, and I beg the coaches that are even joining my team, like, this needs to feel right for you. If this does not feel right for you, then don't, then don't do it. Do it. Like don't I, I've actually shut the door. I stopped two people because I'm like, you're this isn't this isn't right for you. Like go find something that so you have to be aligned with it. As a health coach, guys, we are looked at as an authority. You have yeah. to be okay with every single ingredient and process from when the start of that product is made, how it's grown, the soil till the very ending testing. Because if you get if you trip up on on one thing where you say, oh. I actually wouldn't feed my kids that, but like you should buy the pack. You're going to lose people's trust right away. So that's why I took nine months to analyze it while I was taking an advanced course. And once everything lined up, I knew that for me, I wanted to include gut brain health within my business. And, and I think the big thing is, please guys, like I've seen this uh, 10 years in coaching. I will, and I've seen this and I, and this is not, I mean, look, I, I do network marketing. It's not, it's not my top business. Um, but I look at it as, great money to go into yeah, that's bar, bar and bat mitzvah retirement and college yeah. funds. It's a wonderful thing. Yeah. Um, I've seen coaches hop around. Don't hop because I know you may say, Oh my God, some things like really, but then talk about that. Say, you know, I left this company. Mm -hmm. It was a great company. Really be transparent yeah. because trust gets just gets flushed down the toilet when you hop mm -hmm. and you don't just look like a cute bunny. You look like somebody that's like, Oh, that didn't work for me. So now I'm hopping mm -hmm. to this other company because they have a better comp plan or they have a better this. And so I really encourage you to have that impure alignment, but also explain to your community yeah. why it is. And Jessica and I were talking about it on our way home from this amazing, whole yummy place. And we're going to mm, wait to finish yum. the rest of it. <laughs> um, but we were talking about like, it, and similar to what we talk about in IG, and it's a really important topic in this digital era. And I don't mean just when you're marketing, even if you're working offline, you're still what? Using opt-in freebies, or maybe you're on LinkedIn, you're still in the digital space, finding clients. You want to polarize. You want to know what are those buckets that you focus on. So if that network marketing company doesn't fit in your bucket, you may have to, even if that works for you, and we were talking about this earlier, mm -hmm. you may have to abandon it because maybe it doesn't really fit either soul, doesn't fit alignment, maybe you've grown past it. Yeah. And so that's when you really want to say, is this working for my business? Is this working for soul? Is this working also for the big vision? And if it's not, it's okay. Like then you allow yourself to make that big step. I think a lot of times people are very consumed about, oh, what if I do leave? Um, if it's not in alignment, you can pretend all you want that people are not going to see that they see it. So when I found something that did work, I found a program that I, I could write it into perfectly. And I was able to, so let me think, that was my ninth month. And then I, so I just decided to actually finally like do it. I would, I, and I have to say, like I said, I am not part of this network marketing. Mm -hmm. I kind of watch like this. 
Yeah. <laughs> I was like, wait. Um, yeah. Why, like why isn't what? she doing one with Nate? What? Because she yeah. just was like this. Boom. Yeah. Like once it once it hit me that it aligned and this is what I knew could help people, I was like, okay, well then I'm taking this to the masses. This, this is a no brainer. And I so I did um, the Restore Your Gut. And I, I put the products in there, the mental wellness, wellness products in there and my people thrived. And I not only made money on the program, um, but I got a team of other health coaches to join me. And now their and them and their clients are benefiting. Um, I got a trip to Mexico that month and yeah, I, I think I jumped. <laughs> she was times. like, I can't be a moderator guy yes, for, for like because, two weeks. Cause I'm going to be, <laughs> and then every picture was like, all right, the beach. <laughs> I was like, I love you guys. I'll be back in a little bit, but I'm just going to go work and v- vacation. And no, honestly, she was like, no, I'm, I'm really going to just go vacation <laughs> with my family. <laughs> I did check in once in a while. But I'm really and she was like, I'm checking in from the beach. Yeah. And, and um, I was able to bring my sons and my husband. I love it. Because <laughs> it's so true. And this is why we're trying to tell you, like, you guys there can is do a, this. Right. And, and the, okay. The, the reason I'm laughing so hard is, okay, yes, I do love this woman so much, but is that we both, and especially because Jessica has been a moderator with me, but also when we met at Iron Live, we talked about this massive disconnect that we're seeing of coaches working so hard, so frustrated, um, spending so much money, um, spending so much time. I would say like, we even have talked about this, like maybe on an IG profile that isn't even converting for them. So they think they have to just show up in every different place. Mm -hmm. Um, And, and really what Jessica nailed. And I think that's the big message is it has to really work, not only for matching your story. So no, your business, your business (laughs) is about your ideal client, but guess what? If, you're trying to sell something that doesn't make sense to this hero journey that you're trying to take somebody on this zero, the ground zero to like the step one, two, and three. Um, And for Jessica, the next stage was that she added on this network marketing, but didn't just do. And I I hear this day, people call and say, Rachel, I'm struggling with network marketing, which one of your programs can help. And I always say, tell me about first you then tell me about network marketing because I can't tell you how many people have contacted me and said, you know, I bought this program or I'm trying to do this. It's not working. And they tell me their story. And I say, I would never even think that you would have that program. Yeah. Or you have this program, but you're trying to sell something that is this. So, um, what Jessica did right. And that's the big theme is she showed up consistently, even before this, this launch of a program that can be four weeks. Yeah. That can be three weeks. Start to think about these three areas of your life. These, these buckets. I love that term bucket. Bucket. It's so easy to know that once you fill that, like you have I almost, I'm like, which, where am I? Gonna, so many, so many amazing things. <laughs> Hold on. Here. I'm going to bring over the bucket. Yeah. I think I have something. Here, here's some bucket. These are your freebies. Freebie, freebie, freebie. This is what, these are not like, oh my God, I think it's so, you know, this is one that's on exactly what I focus on. This person may not even know that they have this issue. I can't tell you how many times I was a gut specialist and I realized very fast Mm -hmm. (laughs) that nobody even knew what a gut issue Mm -hmm. was. So I had to learn that people (laughs) needed, right. I had to actually start saying like, you know, eight steps so you could have a flatter belly. And at first I was like, oh, that's such a sellout thing. Even though I worked with people with autoimmune, but I realized like, Some people didn't even understand that the ear, nose, and the throat was connected. Like, so I had to pull diagrams and I just start talking about that. These are your freebies. You might have even buckets. Like these are the three areas of your business that you focus on Mm -hmm. and everything on your work with me should match. A do-it-yourself program should match. It's when we deviate 
that is a signature business. And even if you think about it, even within hormones, yeah. like, are you, fo- what area of that? It could be the whole, you know, big picture. But when you really start to get to the nitty gritty, you know, you'll start to test and see, wow, you know, where do people, where are people really called with me? Is it estrogen dominance? Is it the digestive health part? Is it blood sugar? And so in the discovery part, of our business. And I think that's the misbelief is that so many coaches, especially new, and I did this, I compared myself to these coaches that were like at this advanced stage. Oh, me too. Big time. And sure. so I had to put myself in like a no comparison zone and just say, stand my own lane, make money back, put it away, be able to then like set aside money to be able to invest back for a virtual assistant mm-hmm. when I was able. And that was at year three and a half. And that was okay. And I had to let go of perfection so that I could hone in on my message and continue to do what? Network, meet more people, get clear instead of just investing, investing, investing in like platform after platform after platform. Um, Yeah. And just feel like we're spending my lane. Yeah, exactly. And I think too, the more that when Rachel's saying like show up, even if you if you're reading an awesome book on nutrition that you just love or, or even something that's not and you, something right here is like, oh my gosh, the world needs to know this. Get on your Facebook page and do a three minute live video about it. And that is how when a local friend or someone even online says like, oh my gosh, um, these people are having digestive issues in my whatever exactly. practice. I'm going to call Jess. Like that's what happened. You. Yeah. And they personal message you. Yeah. And that's how you get it. So when you just, you know, when you are learning information that don't say like, oh, I'll just wait until I write this into one of these big classes. <laughs> no, I've gone online so many times and just been like, Hey guys, did you know that if you have anxiety, depression, like your serotonin is made in your gut, click done. And people are like, what? And then I can message them back and say like, are you struggling with this and take it on a DM and, and really figure out what or a PM. Yes. PM. DM. DM. Yes. DM. PM. <laughs> um, and take that off so that, so that there's where you're, we are, I knew we were going to do something ridiculous. Anyway. Yeah. yeah. Like where, so that's how you find out. Too much kombucha. You're, way too much kombucha. Gut health though. So I mean, come on. Um, but even stuff like that, you know, when, when you're, when people are coming to you and saying, you know what, I didn't even realize this could be an issue. Can you help me with this? And that's where you can gain your confidence in saying like, yeah, I think I can. And that's how I got from this one um, program that I ran of Rach's that I put in with my network marketing. Um, People were feeling good from the program. They were feeling good from the products and they hired me as a one-on-one coach because they then knew, wow, I have a lot more issues. I think the end thing, and we will, we will leave you guys with this so that we can go finish our lunch, but also so that you guys can even think about where are you today is When I think about health and wellness branding, I look at it as a very different business than many other businesses, because even if you have a program that's a platform, really what, why that person hires is because trust. Number one. They're, They're hiring you. And so when you're new, or if you have no list, or you have a small list and you're like, how do I get to this next place? you have to show up Mm -hmm. and you have to say things to yourself. Like I just have to take a chance Mm -hmm. because you don't always know what people are going to be attracted to. But I will tell you this and Jessica just said it. When you can become known as a person that shares really interesting stuff, Mm -hmm. stuff that is not just in a book or is not like common or that you are the person who is doing that research and brings it to a place. Guess what? People are going to want to follow you, get to know you more, download your freebies and find out where you're hanging out and go to the workshops that you are hosting or the webinars. So with that being said, we hope that you have an amazing day. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. You want to tell everyone where to find you? Yeah. So you can find me um, now that I have a business page on Facebook, (laughs) Um, Jess Royston, J-E-S. Royston, R-O-Y-S-T-O-N. Uh, my nutrition blog is Green Mama Tribe and Instagram, Green Mama Tribe and friend me on Facebook, Jessica Royston, anything. You can go to her <laughs> stuff and I'm attached to all her stuff. So definitely reach out if you have any questions on specifics or anything that you are still after this saying like, well, what about this? Um, reach out to us. That's what we're here for. So we hope and you're guys, helpful. you know where we live, yourhealthcoachbiz.com. But if you want to go get 
free stuff and go to the start hair page, go to rachelafeldman.com. We will see you later. Have a beautiful day. And remember, do not quit on this biz. Simplify it. Simple wins the race. All right, guys. We will see you guys later. Again, take it easy. Thanks so much. Bye, IG. Bye, Facebook. Keep it real.